Amity Rose Won't you come out tonight Wanna see you sparkle Beneath that prairie moonlight Wanna take you dancing So we can hold each other tight I love you so My Amity Rose My Amity Rose Welcome my brothers and sisters up to the beautiful caribou country was where I'm hanging my hat here these days for a little while. I like to travel around and spend time at my friend's place and set up my teepee and and uh, just have good visits and stuff like that because our country's so beautiful and it's just uh, something that I've always liked to do. I've been doing this for, oh, probably since uh, 90, 92, 93, yeah, so it's been lots of fun and and right now what we've done, we've we thought about uh, having a few uh, teepee talks is what we're calling it, or teepee sessions, I'm not really sure which, but uh, maybe both. Because we've got some great friends, uh, musicians, and, and uh, friends that come by over the years I've known. I've been in the music business for 40, 50 years now, so they like to come by and we like to play songs. We do a lot of original songs and yeah, we talk about lots of stuff. Uh, stuff that's going on locally and in the community and the stuff that's going on all over the world and uh, some pretty interesting uh, topics come up and we have some good conversations about these things and and I hope you uh, I hope you join me and I, and I hope you uh, I hope you enjoy the show I guess uh, that's what I'm trying to say here but uh, anyways come along and we'll uh, we'll head down towards the, uh, the teepee there and I got my friend coming by, Mr. T, for a visit, so we'll see what goes on here. But this is a beautiful, uh, a beautiful chunk of property that my friend has, Sue Moss. And uh, I've known for about eight years, and uh, looks like we're going to rig in here and get a garden going, because we've got the COVID thing going. We might as well get some uh, some food going here, too, eh? So it's a... They're up pretty high here, about 4,000 feet above sea level, so we've got a shorter growing period, that's for sure, but, uh, and lots of rain, but, uh, hey, summer's coming up, I know it's going to be really warm, so who knows, we might be fighting fires again this year, but, uh, crazy weather going on, friends, so, here we are, this is getting close to the old TP. yeah, let's go inside and have a look and see what's going on here. Come on in. You're going to enjoy this. Teepee talks are... We're going to start off with a little teepee session here. We always start off with a good song first. And then we talk about it afterwards. And this is my good buddy, Mr. T. I was telling you all howdy. about. He'd be dropping by. Here he is, Phil. Howdy. Say hi. Good to see you, buddy. You good kid? to see you. Always are you ready to do a tune? a pleasure to come down to this teepee. I love this place. I know. Yeah, I'm ready to sing a song. You know, you got a great song here. And I told mm. you that years ago. And no one's even heard the song. It's not even published or registered yet. Right. But it is now. I mean, we... I mean, I've actually done that for you, so it's protected. Know, Everything's good. I know, so uh, let's Here check we go. it out. Check and then out. we'll talk about it after. Right. I got some so, questions I want to ask you. All right, sounds good. A little Hollywood there. South Kirk Travelers, 1800 and some. From across the great water, many white men come. When they got to Red River, a major fur trade town, there was laughter and music on the medicine ground. Brown skinned people, not white, not cream, answering to no one. Living proud and free, they would dance with a fiddle and the powwow rum. They would hunt like a devil on a buffalo run. One and a half man, one and a half man, one and a half man, one and a half man. Hey, Pushed across their land to Saskatchewan River 
where they made their stand. The liberty and freedom have a price to pay. And many paid with blood on the ground that day. One and a half men. friends that, that that's absolutely wonderful thank you now i met your uncle yes smoky smoky t the smoke jumper yep uh frank yep he was Another. one of the creek hole talkers and he was a smoke jumper and a smoke jumper i met them both and we had him up on stage singing with us at the old new west yeah, hotel awesome. remember that that was yeah. a highlight of my <laughs> me too of that uh, year man that was that wonderful that having those old boys trip. up yeah. Yeah. And Frank passed on, I guess, uh, now, but uh, Smokey's still going, having a tough time, but... Uh, no, he's hanging in there. Didn't he say something to you that kind of coincided with the time that I gave you, the, uh, like, well, a book to read? Well, or? the funny thing about the, the song is, uh, I was talking to Smokey one day, and uh, he told me about the one and a half man. He says, do you know the story about the one and a half man people? He said, I said, no, I never heard of that. He says, well, that's what they used to call Métis people back in the day. Why is that? And then he told me the story. And coincidentally, about a week later, I'm talking to you, and you say, hey, have you ever read this book, T? Here's a, here's a book called One and a Half Man, and it's got a picture of uh, Jim Brady on the front, which is a very good friend of my family. Malcolm Norris. And, Malcolm uh, Norris. And, but Jim Brady was right on the, and the, Peter front, of the front of the thing. So I opened it up, and right in the uh, preface is where they have this uh, story about the One and a Half Man. I said, well, this is too coincidental not to write a song about it. So Yeah. So I commenced to write this song. I plagiarized a, a little bit of those words, maybe, but uh, the story is still basically true. And uh, yeah, and I like the song. It's got a good beat. And wait till that fiddle kicks in. Oh yeah, man! Every, you know, everyone I've actually played the song too just loves it. They just said, "Gee, that's really, really good." Right on. Tells a good story, it. and you know, and uh, yeah. I think it should be uh, somewhere in the Mati archives. Uh, you know, like hopefully, maybe somewhere down the road, we can talk to uh, Gabriel Dumont Institute and maybe. Uh, you never know. They might, uh, yeah, because I think they both know. I well, I know they know Frank and Smokey, and and they're very aware of them, you know. And and uh, we actually did a few shows together. It was on Remembrance Day mm -hmm. when I had a chance to uh, see Frank again in Saskatoon. He was the elder there, talking, speaking to the young ones at the schools, and uh, you know, telling his story about war and stuff like that. And it was so powerful. I mean, the man was, uh, he was, he was just, well, he was, I think he was 92, 93 at the time, yeah. you know, and he had his walker and, and, uh, he got up there and he, and he told the kids, you know, what a terrible thing war really is. And he said, it's nothing like Hollywood and, uh, you know, and all the make believe, uh, uh, all exciting blowing up and no one, and no one dying. And, and, uh, you know, like this stuff, he said, well, and he, there was tears in his eyes yeah. when he said, wait until you see your friends blowing up beside you or shot, you know, and he yeah. said it's absolutely the most horrific things that you could ever see. But the greatest point uh, that, that he had made that really hit me was, it was so powerful was that here was this elder who's, who, who'd gone through so much, uh, you know, with the Creek Hole Talkers too, mm -hmm. you know, he was an amazing guy. But he said this with, with all his heart and tears in his eyes. He said, I wish the old, the, the men that start these wars could go out and fight these wars so they'd see what they're like. Mm -hmm. He said, Absolutely. it's a terrible, terrible thing. And it was just so powerful because, you know, I had written a song about uh, Pray for the Veterans, it was called, and stuff like that. So, I mean, you know, he made a big in impact on mm -hmm. me, old Frank. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But thanks for your, thanks for coming by and, and uh, sharing at great songs you know with this my, we'll do, my we'll brother do. man let's do some more here i'd like to do some more yeah. yeah and if you like the uh the show folks there just click the old subscribe button there and my midi rose won't you come out tonight wanna see you sparkle beneath that prairie moon